G'day everyone. In my last video, I said that I was doing a backyard ultra. Also, since that last video, I had a subscriber basically begging me, asking me to do a video of how I'm training for the backyard ultra. That's what this video is right here. I've probably titled it something clickbaity, like how to train for a backyard ultra, but realistically, this is just how I'm training for it. So I'm just gonna throw to Monday and show you through my week. Eight k's done, 5.55 per kilometre. It was supposed to be 5.30 to 5.45. We just had to slow down today. 12 hours since I did the long run. Legs are tired, legs are heavy. Bounced out of bed though, which was nice. So yeah, good start to the week. Really good start to the week. Public holiday today, and then back to work tomorrow. Let's enjoy one last day of rest. Good morning. Five something on Tuesday. The workout today is 11Ks at easy pace, finding hills, and then pushing hard up and down the hills. The whole purpose is to smash the quads. And that's what I'm doing. Oh. Now the problem is, the spot that I found is all hills. There's no rest in between. Let's keep going. That's the workout done. 13 Ks at 5.12 per K. Accidentally overshot the loop. Turned right and went for one more hill when I should have come home. So an extra two Ks. Oops, I have to take it easy one day this week. Okay, six k's done. That's hard work this morning. Hard work to get out. I went too hard yesterday. So today, just massage on the legs, nice easy pace. Six minute pace in the end. Just slow, slow and easy. Six more k's in the bank. That's what that's about. Ready to go again tomorrow. And that's Thursday done. Group run, 10 k's. Progression run, starting at about 4.45s. Kicking down under fours to 7k then a break and then last three k's have sort of well i think i did about 410 pace but it's basically an effort back to the start but yeah try to add a bit on to the start and the end it's 12 k's total 6 30 now i'm gonna go and get the kids ready for school Okay, so 8K's done. Somewhere between 5 and 5.30 pace. Haven't checked the paces yet. Had to quickly run home, find myself a child, and then get ready to go for park run. It's our first birthday at park run this week. 13 k's total this morning. Let's get another 5K in. And we're back. 8Ks at a very easy jogging pace tonight. I must take the total for today up to 21. Ready for a 22K long run tomorrow morning. I'm just gonna slow myself down at the moment. Yeah. All of a sudden, every time I look down, legs are moving quicker than I want. Oh, let's just take it easy. Enjoy the jog. And that's okay stuff. 21 total for the day. Uh, 535 pace for that one. Nice and easy. Uh, ready to back up for 22 tomorrow. See you in the morning. Bye now.
And g'day. We're back. Sunday morning. We're three and a bit k's into the long run. Just at the top of the hill. Uh, trying to sit between 5 and 5.30 pace. But it is 9 o'clock in the morning. So that means it is effing hot. And the sun is beating down like you wouldn't believe. So it's going to be a tough run. But it's about toughing it out. Last big run. Last big, big run before the event. Cool. Legs are fairly tired this morning, fairly tight. Just, not really sore, but just, yeah, just tired. Cause yeah, 21 Ks yesterday total. And then yeah, aiming for 22 this morning. <sighs> These hills are just exhausting. Already sweating buckets. Drank a lot of water this morning. Had some electrolytes too. Hopefully I'll make it through without having to stop and fuel or anything like that, but we'll see how it goes. Oh. It's gonna be a long run. Who knows where this is gonna go. And we're six k's in, just over a quarter of the way through, and I've just realized I forgot to lube up my nipples. Nipple update, just starting to feel them. That's a good sign when I've got 16 k's to go, right? Eight and a half k's in now. Just pushed up a little bit of a hill. Things are starting to pinch a bit. Oh, it's hot. It's hard work. But we're getting it done. Sitting on five ten pace because I'm just coasting down the hill now. But yeah, slight undulations that I'm not used to. Just hurt me. Let's keep going. Last big one. I can do it. We're just under 11 k's in, like 10.8 or something. I'm at the top of a, an incline, found a nice flat spot. I'm gonna stop and take a bit of a walk back and forth for a few minutes. I'm absolutely exhausted, absolutely cooked. Nearest drink tap's like four k's away. So, I'm gonna go and find that. Oh, it's hot. 12 k's in, quick nipple update. Right one, sore. Left one, pleasant compared to that. Gotta remember to lube them up. Gotta remember. Idiot. Oh. 10 k's to go. Keep jogging. Fifteen point seven k's in. Six point three k's to go. About a hundred meters of elevation up and down. What I've got left is very similar to what I have to do right leg back out. Let's be honest, this chat was just an excuse to stop it with the down. I desperately want to get in there. One more lap to go. Still. Point eight k's to go. Just give you a brief look at what I've got to climb up. Sitting on five forties though, so while I'm getting hungry, really starting to struggle in that apartment, the legs are ticking over so easy compared to what I have to do in two weeks. Whew. Let's go. Full straight. Four k's to go. I'm halfway up that hill. There's two pinch points here that I've decided to walk. Oh, that wind. Just so that I get used to giving myself permission to slowing down. And for 
permission to slow down, so take it easy. And not push that pace, because that's what I'm a shocker for. Right. Let's get to the top of the hill. Jog down to the next one, walk up that one. No, not far from home. Really, it's quite short. Pretty proud of myself today. Starting to hit the wall a little bit, but I still feel fairly strong. Headphones are going flat, which is annoying, but I still feel okay. Just ticking those legs over. So it's starting to flatten out now. So I'll jog over the rise and then down the hill. Oh. Yeah, see, they hurt. They're tired. They're okay. Bye for now. I'm just at the top of the hill. 2.7 k's to go. Just walked up that last one. Oh, geez, I'm thirsty. And hot and hungry. I think I'm gonna have to carry a water bottle on me the whole way when I do it. Um, there's just no two ways around that, I don't think. Yeah. I think that's the way to go. All right, gonna jog down this hill, jog home. Jog on. That's it, I'm done. No more, 21.97. I need water, desperately need water. I'm going in, bye now.